they can't even break that down. What? Because the Valley of Shadow of Death is really fucking Babylon. Yeah, Babylon. Uh -huh. That's right. This is the Valley of Shadow of Death. When you hear that, when Puppy said it, I don't think no one fucking meant either. He said that? Yeah. Or what? He, and, um, you know, um, you know, by somebody killed you and bit you second house. And ain't no fucking thing like said that. You know? I guess you're just saying that it's biblical pages just to be like, oh, he reads the Bible or he's on point. Nah, man. I mean, I see people when they go, I go to people's houses and they got the book of Psalms, open man, and I'd be like, what that mean? And they don't know it. You know what I'm saying? Like, come on, man. Just something they heard. Yeah, so they heard. Just need it all for to be like, oh, righteous. Not like, because they said, what am I? I am I brought a nice staff comfort me. What is it talking about? <laughs> yeah. Oh, look, man. Some twenty three, yeah. Mine this is the measuring stick. This is the comforter. Okay. Take this book right here. That comforts. Right. That's what it says. It's gonna say things are written a fourth time written by learning. That's me through the comfort of the scriptures. Yeah. Might have both. That's the comfort of that word. That's it. Bye bye. Now the only thing is why is the woman got to church in where it is now? Why? Yeah. Say what? Say why the Catholic Church? And when it is now? So they call it Saint Peter's was basically the first. I mean, the apostle for Jesus. Like he said, he's going. Yeah, see, uh, like, I mean, he was the first apostle. He was the head guy, but he was the Lord that there was no pope. No. The word pope means what? Emperor. It means holy father. And that's what he said. Don't call no man on earth father, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And that's exalting yourself. Yeah. But then he wasn't he the first. They called the first pope. That's something that they can get. Yeah. Man, how people with a busy empire can come to that. And two, they bow down to idols. That's like against the second commandment. You weren't supposed to have idols up, man. Yeah. That's a basic, basic, basic commandment. What idols? They have idols of the Virgin Mary, uh, so-called Virgin Mary, the crosses, the crosses, bowing down to it. Does not the truth say, thou shalt not make us be any graven in any light of the heavens above, the earth, and the heavens. Not yeah, even man. Jesus. Nah, no, I said, you want to get this? Get ready to get that. No, no, that doesn't even the picture. I mean, people who have the uh, nah, picture of the cross and all. Any image, that's an image. Even though we know Jesus is like black man like that, yeah. you don't want out for that picture. Not the people read it. The people read it, but they don't understand it. Because I had a um, and that's I showed you that that's false. What? And then on top of that, um, they teach Mary was a virgin. Yeah. The idols, this pope foolishness, worship on Sunday, Easter, bunny rabbit sling egg, Christmas pagan. What else? <laughs> um, I mean, the list goes on and on and on. So and then you got all these Christ said, um, you know them by their fruit. They've been accused of this pedophilia thing for so long. Yeah. No way the most high could be dealing with y'all. Oh, and they teach. You know, if you be a bishop, you got you can't have no children. You can't have a woman. Why did that come from? I don't know where that comes from. Then you got the, 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 the Catholic Church, that's the a, nuns, that's what not having sex, that's, wickedness, that's your man. job, that's man, to, to have babies, the man. Says the, for the younger woman to marry yep. their children, that's it. That's, a, that's what the Bible calls the precepts of men. Yeah, because if you want to, what did Pastor Paul say, First Timothy? Yeah, the yeah, yeah, yeah. bishop, yeah. bishop should be good uh, to his yeah. wife. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Children, yeah. yeah. But where did he get that from? Oh, it's, no. it's, it's, it's just real quick. Exodus 20 and 4. Uh, I mean 33. Thou shalt have no other gods before me. And it's a low case G. Thou shalt not make unto thee any graven image or any likeness of anything that is in heaven above. Christ is in the heavens. Great. Above or that is in the earth, beneath or that is in underneath under the earth. The plucker. Or that is in the water under the earth. Thou shalt not bow down thyself to them. No serve them. So even if we had an image of the Lord, yes, stone image, and we bow down, we're still going on. Even if that is how he really looked like. Yeah. Because the truth say you're not supposed to have any likeness of anything that's in heaven above, the earth beneath, or the waters that's under the earth. But why? That thou shalt bow down thyself to them and serve them. So he's supposed to do that. The Lord is in the heavens. Why are you bowing down to a stone? That stone can't see or hear your prayer. You wasting your time. Yeah. I, well, he said what? The heavens is my realm and the earth is my foot.
want to. Like Why you bow down to anything on Earth? Like in that movie, The Ten Commandments, when Pharaoh, when, um, when all of all the, um, the firstborn died, he put up um, um, the sun on a statue. He said, I will build you a bigger statue, a bigger house. And his wife said, that thing can't hear you. <laughs> his old wife said, that thing can't hear you. And it literally means when the scripture looks says, I'll bear the cross. No. That doesn't mean to wear the cross around your neck, you idiot. That doesn't mean to what? The father, when the father's affliction that Christ came, I'm, I'm dead. You know what I'm saying? That's a deep burden. That's disrespect. Yeah. 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 Let me zoom in. Yeah, this is right here. Uh, this is just uh, oh, this is just weird. Agent, Don't worry about it. Uh, what's the agent? Um, yeah. <laughs> so agent what orange. What does that say? What does that say? Uh, I'm gonna read it right uh, now. This is uh, the Christmas tree. Jeremiah. Jeremiah 10 verse 1. Hear ye the word which the Lord speaketh unto you, O house of Israel. Thus saith the Lord: Learn not the word of the heathen, and be not dismayed at the size of heaven, for the heathen are dismayed at dumb. For the custom of the people are vain. For one cut up a tree out of the forest. The work of the hands of the workmen with the axe. That's a Christmas tree. We gonna keep reading. That's in the ancient Babylon. That's what chapter? Jeremiah 10. Jeremiah, Jeremiah 10. 10. Jeremiah. They deck it with silver and with gold. That's a Christmas tree. Back then they used to deck it with silver and gold. And they used to give gifts underneath the tree. But Jesus was born. Yes. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. That's what he's saying. That has nothing to do with Christ. That goes back to Babylon. That's what the Catholics did. They, they merged paganism with the Bible to get more followers. But they just put Christ's name on it. That had nothing to do with Christ. That goes back to Tom. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But what did the Lord say in verse 1? It says, Heed the word which the Lord speaketh unto you, O house of Israel. What did he say? Give me this. Thus said the Lord, Learn not the way of the heathen. He said, Learn not the way of the Don't follow that. Yeah. Stay away from these customs. 
and be not dismayed at the signs of heaven. Right, we're just talking about the stars. Yeah, yeah you see like thing. the shooting stars. Yeah. And don't be like, who are you? You know what I mean? See, sometimes it's amazing, because you barely see certain things. Like, when I was in South Carolina, I saw two shooting stars. Yeah. And one of them, one of my nephews, friends saw the last one. Yeah. And he thought it was bugging. And he said, have you seen it? And I said, I've seen it. Oh, it must be South Carolina. I lay, and you know, the sky, the south is open. Man, we used to see, I see the chariots, man. Just yeah, playing with saying, each other. I'll be up in the Bronx. I'll be catching them. Yeah, you're catching them all over. What does that mean? Huh? What does that mean? What? Shooting stars? What? Shooting stars? Yeah. Those are the things in the heavens that just the most high for himself. Don't be, ooh, don't be like, like, frightened. Because it's, yeah. it's just there. There's so many yeah. things out there, man. And like, it's just crazy. Like, like. Like I said, I'll be in South Carolina, South Carolina. I just yeah. lay in my sister's hood of the car and look up in the sky, man, and you see chariots. Just yeah. zoom like this, boom, boom, this. And I'm looking at amazement, man, like, wow, like, you know, because you know I mean, like, this is, you know what I mean? But now it's like, you see, you be like, oh, it's a chariot. They don't bother no more. No, it's a chariot, man. You know what I mean? Like, but you, you, people be scooped out about of that, man. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people be spooked out. See, but you see, with me, I'm a little different, you know, when it comes to chariots, because to me, in my own opinion, not only is chariots you see uh, of the angels of the heavenly right, father, right, right, a lot right. of them are corrupted right. beings right. that are wicked as hell and actually control these things. Oh, it could be true, so you got angels to the left hand. That's when you see them, you can't always say, oh, that's, you know, the wall or something. Well, you know what? So I'm going to bring out first king. Right. I'm going to bring it out. I'm going to bring yeah. it out right now. So I got first king. Because the most I do, the angels on the left hand side also. That's right, right. right. Figure it out now. The book of Matt, uh, First Kings, chapter twenty-two, verse. Now I'm gonna start at verse uh, nineteen. Uh, All right. It says, and he said, Hear thou therefore the word of the Lord. I saw the Lord sitting on his throne, and all the hosts of heaven standing by him on his right hand and on his left. And the Lord said, Who shall slay Ahab, that he may go up and fall to the realm of Shali? And one of this manner said, one well, of this manner, and the other said in that manner. So right now, they're having some conversation. Like, who's going to slay this king? Who's going to, you know what I'm saying? So guess what, both the angel the left hand side and the right hand side are speaking. Um, reading on. That article was interesting where, uh, I'm sorry, Benedict and, uh, oh, oh, yeah, the man. Man. When I saw that, I had to say that on my phone. Yeah. But yeah. even, even the St. Patrick, they have, the yeah. Dog, the, yeah. Benedict the 16th, pure Satan. They yeah. Know, anybody can look at his face and the way he, like, the no, why did he resign? Yeah. Say that why did he resign? Man of the Lord is crazy. Uh, nah. Why and did he resign? Totally that was the prophecy. Who? Benedict the 16th. No, but it, it is prophesied that they will cover the faces of the judges, which they did. All people are the judges. And they covered the faces. You ever see him? You ever see his face? I'm like, yo, you know, he looks like a little bit. Um, he was also, that, uh, uh, also uh, that dude from Star Wars, the Dark Lord. Um, for Star Wars, the one who, who got his Darth Vader, the Darth Vader. I know his name. I know who you're talking about. I don't know his name. I've got his name. All of them. That's a part of their ritual. If you get a book called um, Sexual Magic, it goes into the Catholic Church. How uh, uh, they lose their innocence as a child. So they believe the only way to get it back is by doing another little boy. Because the, the highest form of uh, sexual magic is a little boy's booty. That's why they all get caught in there. Witchcraft. Was the, they deal with spirits on the left. You see what I'm saying? They get power from the left. That's what they worship. Satan. You see what I'm saying? Anything, anything that's wicked or evil, that's what they do. That means that you know, that's not the right way. That's sex, the whole sexual. You could go into that. That's why people in Hollywood, all the famous directors, all these famous businessmen, they all do that. They all do that. Not only the Catholics, they all do that. But you know, even in Africa, a lot of. I mean, I'm from Cameroon. A lot of them. Really, a lot. You know what I'm saying? So it's good that she raised me in the country. So those are basically great. 
Yeah, that's rituals, yeah. Yeah, rituals. On the outside, they try to look good, but behind closed door, they wicked as hell. See what I'm saying? Yeah, we need this. I don't need this. Yeah, we need Yo, we not surprised. Sorry about that. Now he's yeah. Ask, ask, ask the brother the question where you asked me. Which one? He said about uh, how that the uh, the Catholic Church they have the icons on their garments in the wall, but they they tell people that Jesus is white. They have the black icons. Yeah, they yeah. have the black icons in their garments, but they're telling people he's white. Well, the more like the the more like this. Now, the people who see these things, they stupid. They stupid. They stupid. Well, if, I, if, I, if I see a white man, right, a white like the Pope, and he got black Jesuits, I mean, a black priest, right, apostles, and he says Jesus Christ is white. Now they gonna make, they gonna make you feel like, like a video is called, hmm, gonna make you think, right? Yeah. So now it's up to you to do your own research, right? Yeah. Now, like you said, you didn't know that Christ was white. I mean, was black man, right? No, I've seen a lot. Of you them. seen, but, but then all these movies. Claiming that, oh, Jesus Christ was a white man. We know he was a black, dark skinned man with afros. Yeah. Right? Now it's up to you to do that, um, to be so, unless the Lord put the Spirit on you. That's what it is. You know is. what I'm saying? The Spirit. To discern the Spirit. Yes. For him to be like, oh, okay. I knew for some reason, even I wasn't the truth yet, I was like, he had to be like a dark skinned or maybe olive skinned type man. But when? It was the Middle East. You know what I'm saying? He came from the Middle East. Right? Yeah. But in the Bible, it's scary telling you that he was a dark skinned man. So now if you see that movie that came out, well, it's on a, um, on Son of God. View, um, Son of God. It's a garbage. Son of God movie, right? And that's the weakest Jesus I ever seen. The Which weakest one? dude. This new one, like Son of God? Name, man. That's the weakest, weakest. Like they made him soft and feminine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 I mean, even the old Jesus says, even though he was white, it was just, it was, yeah, yeah it was. He like perfect pain, he was high, he was too soft, his back was hunched, you know what I'm saying? I mean, The Passion of Christ was a good movie. It was a good movie. This but this Christ was yeah. a steel yeah. man. Christ was yeah. a really, Jewish man. Still man. Yes. See, they do they need to do, and he don't got the balls to do it either. They should have Oprah Winfrey and all these, so, these black celebrities who got the money to give Spike Lee, like they did for Malcolm X, right? Do a Malcolm X film, but do a real black Jesus. Man, man, Spike could be assassinated the next fucking day, man. Oh, they would destroy him in the media. They would destroy him, man. Racist. Yeah, for bringing out a Black Jesus movie. Yeah. I mean, and so Oprah, so Oprah don't got the balls to do that. But then, then, then why, why, why just go? go man? Because it's all prophesied. Remember, the Bible said, "Many shall come in my name." Yeah. Say, "My cry shall deceive me." It was like prophesied that gonna happen. Yeah. Yeah. That's what the Bible said. What the earth is given to the hands of the wicked. Yes. He covered the faces of the judges thereof. And it was already prophesied. And that, so he that, covered the faces of the judges. Is that what it is? The yeah. Israelites. That's what he said. Um, because Paul was talking about the Romans. Um, in fact, the Greeks did the same thing too when they took us down yeah. during the time of Judas Maccabees. I'm gonna read and get it. And then and also what that of the, the Napoleon when he went over to Egypt. Shooting down the faces of the Sphinx and because they had wide noses and big lips and he destroyed that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That is just how the white people is, man. They they, they take what they can't have. You know? I mean, but that's probably they're gonna take it anyway. You know what I mean? They're gonna take it anyway. But it's set up that way. Like he yeah. says, in Job 9:24, the earth is given hand to the wicked. There's nothing we can do but what? Get Wait for the, the Lord to get to the Lord, man. To take it down. First Maccabees 3:48. Yeah. So talking about the Matthew Greeks. Chapter 3, verse 48 in the Apocrypha. And they have opened the book of the law. That's what the Greeks did. They laid open the book of the law and did what? Wherein the heathen have sought to paint the likeness of the images. Hear that? They paint the image of themselves. Oh, we did that. We did that. We did that. Oh, that's us. The white man always does that. Always. Steal from other, Steal from other nations and claim it for his own. And that's that, just that. They t okay, for instance, like... Let's look at hip hop, right? You know, you see the actually the pressure bike actually started the hip hop thing, right? Now, as, as, as they're gonna do commercials, they want the white man, this and that. Even Buster Rock said that 
Hip hop made jobs for people who don't love this shit. People who don't like this shit for what they they paid jobs for them. Now let's look at sports. Let's look at boxing. The superior boxing, blacks and Hispanics, the Mexicans, right? Now they gotta have back then Rocky Marciano. You know, which this fight was fixed. Fucking um um trying to have um yeah, but I mean. I think it's so so awesome. You know what, these guys asked which rapper Larry Holmes, you know? We're going to prove that. So they're not mad. We're going to prove that.